Hello everyone, how are you? It's been a while since I last posted a video and I could not think of a better day, day than today to make a video and share with you how I am feeling right now. So today is my birthday, it's 28th of August 2020 and I have turned 33 years old. Now, I haven't shared this news with a lot of people, not even some of my close friends and loved ones, but my mum passed away on 3rd of August this year and the last few weeks have been emotionally very challenging because I could not be with her in her last days because of COVID international travel was restricted so I could not travel to India and I could not be with my mum and with my family during the last days of her life and that is the reality she left her physical body and she's moved on to the next phase of life and I could not say goodbye to her physically and that has been emotionally very very painful to accept and move on with but today is my birthday and traditionally in Hindu culture and widely in India when somebody close to us passes on there's this thing about not celebrating festivals or happy occasions like for a year people mourn and do not celebrate any occasion i don't know why but that has been the tradition but i am not going to do that and i am not going to follow it and I am going to celebrate my birthday because today is the day my mother gave me birth and there is no better day than today for me to celebrate the connection I have with her in my 33 years she's been the one relationship that I've had the longest in my life she carried me for nine months and then gave me birth. So there is no way I am not celebrating this day. And that is what I want to say to all of you. If you've lost a loved one and the cultural norms are forcing you not to celebrate, to hell with it all. You celebrate your day, you celebrate every festival and you remember the loved ones in your life because there is no way my mum or your loved ones would want you to be unhappy on the special days that you shared together. My mum made a big fuss of every birthday, my birthday, every year. Even though I moved to UK in 2011, she would still ask me on my every birthday, oh, did you get a new dress for your birthday? How are you celebrating your birthday? So there is no way that today I am not going to celebrate my birthday. And that is what I want to say to you. Discard the stupid social norms and celebrate the life and the memory of the people that are close to you. And the people who are in your life right now, cherish them, love them, tell them you love them. Because just like it happened with me, I could not go, I could not be with my mother, I could not hold her, I could not tell her how much I love her. You don't know what life will bring you might not get a chance to tell your loved ones how much they mean to you. So make the most of the time you have with them and tell them you love them. <sighs> this 
the day. I love you and I love my mom. I am her legacy. She will live on inside of my heart and in my in me. <laughs> I have her 50% of DNA. So even though she has left her physical body, she lives in me somewhere and she lives in my heart and my memories. And so do all of your loved ones. So love and cherish your loved ones. Life loves you. Thank you.